Talking vacuum cleaners, a billion dollar high tech ghost town, and geeky Mother's Day gifts you should never buy your mother. I'm Doug Amit, strap in for the most insanely important mind blowing tech news of the week. Roomba, heads up. Sharp has announced a robotic vacuum called Coco Robo that is not only multilingual, but also has a built in camera. You can see what it sees via your smartphone as it tools around your house, picking up dust and debris, waiting to exchange witty banter with you, such as long time no see. I got a level with you. I souped up my own vacuum cleaner to talk and take pictures, and it was very cute and fun at first, but after they grow up a little bit and get into their teenage years, it's, it's quite a different story. I just, just want to make sure my eyes aren't playing tricks on me. You sat in your charging station until noon, and now you're watching the Kardashians? Is that... that's accurate? I need $20. I gave you $20 yesterday! What, I, do I even want to know what you spent it on? What do you care? All you do is work. You want some money? Here's an idea. Why don't you vacuum? How about you vacuum a little bit? This place is in desperate need of vacuuming. I'm meeting up with Brian later. The industrial strength floor buffer that I told you you were not allowed to see. I don't think so. No. That's where my money's going? You are grounded. I'm taking your battery out and you will not see a nickel. Give me the money or I will show your wife the picture I took of you eating butter by the spoonful straight from the tub. You wouldn't. Stupid camera why I install the camera for no all I have is three dollars a company called Pegasus Holdings is building a high-tech ghost town in New Mexico at a total cost of around a billion dollars the smart city will have no actual residents but will have houses outfitted with self flushing toilets and smart appliances with the goal of determining the direct and indirect benefits and costs the innovations tested would have on our existing infrastructure according to the company Listen, if you want to test technology and innovation, you got to have people around to screw it up. Technology works great without people, but once you throw people into the mix, that's when things start getting crazy. I would be a great person to live in the town. I promise I would do everything to screw everything up, and then they can see what actually works and what doesn't. I just want to watch a DVD. How do I switch it off the TV? Input? Yeah, it's full. I, there's maybe 15 towels in there. 20 towels? It's all towels. No. No input button. I'm looking, oh, there it is. Oh, really? It's too much? Yeah, well, it's broken. I just can't find the handle to flush, I can't flush it. Should I not have twisted the knob on this radiator? <laughs> oh. Automatically flush it? Yeah, no, there's a lot of steam. Yeah, you should probably still send someone out. I, yeah, something just broke off. You should probably send someone out. I know it sounds crazy, but this vacuum is always on the couch and it doesn't actually vacuum anything and it won't let anyone else watch TV. Well, you should probably send someone out. Hey, thank you. Sorry. And last but certainly not least, happy Mother's Day. Here's a look at some of the items on our 10 item list of geeky gifts never to buy mom. A pink taser, why? Because somebody will invariably get tased right after mom opens it. It's her day, she's gonna wanna try out her taser. A USB metallic I love you hand gesture necklace flash drive. The simple rule of thumb when buying jewelry, does it connect to a computer? If not, you're on the right track. The travel slanket, why? Because it's barely okay to wear a slanket when no one else is looking, and if you take it out in public, those things generate enough static electricity to bring down planes, trains, automobiles, and any pacemaker within 500 yards. How do I know? Because I have two of them. They're, they're not safe to wear. Anything labeled beauty gadget presented without comment. Those are just some of the things on the list. Check out the entire list along with all those insanely important mind-blowing tech news stories and more on Techland. Happy Mother's Day, Mom. I love you.